Omeprazole may sound like a fancy word, but it's actually a pretty common medication that many people use daily. Imagine this, you have just enjoyed your favorite pizza, but then comes that familiar and comfortable burning sensation of heartburn. And guess what? That's where omeprazole comes in to save the day. It helps calm down that burning feeling and makes you feel better. So what exactly is omeprazole? Well, it's a type of medication called a proton pump inhibitor. It sounds complicated, but it's straightforward. All you need to know is that it works by reducing the amount of acid your stomach makes. Less acid means less heartburn and a happier stomach. It is often recommended if you have problems like heartburn, acid reflux, or stomach ulcers. These issues happen when there is too much acid in your stomach and it can really cause discomfort. Now, it's true that omeprazole can be really helpful, but long-term use can bring along so many issues for your body. So in the next few minutes, we will look at the bad side effects of omeprazole. After all, it's your health and being informed means making better decisions. The Dr. The Farm D here, welcome and please like and subscribe to the channel. Number 1. Headache Did you know that omeprazole can cause headaches? It's surprising, but it's true. In fact, studies show that about 7% of people experience headaches while taking omeprazole. It's like fixing one problem, but getting a small bump in return. But why did this happen? Well, it's not fully understood, but it is believed that since omeprazole changes the way your stomach works, your body may react to this change with a headache. And here is a funny fact. Women are slightly more likely to experience these headaches than men. Now, if you are dealing with these headaches, there are simple ways to help. Staying hydrated is key. Drink plenty of water. Make sure you're getting enough rest, and you can also try over-the-counter headache medications like Tylenol or Acetaminophen. Number 2. Stomach Issues Now, omeprazole can disrupt the normal balance and functioning of your digestive system. As a result, it can cause side effects related to the stomach and the digestive system, including excessive gas, stomach pain, and diarrhea. You see, these side effects can leave you feeling bloated and super uncomfortable. But the good news is, they are short-lived. Now, keep this in mind. Feeling great is what we all want. So if these symptoms do not improve over time, or you feel unusually uncomfortable, it's a smart idea to discuss it with your healthcare provider, because it could be something more serious than just a temporary side effect. Number 3. Bone Fractures Did you know that taking omeprazole for more than a year could affect your bones? That's right. It can increase the risk of bone fractures, especially in the hip, wrist, and spine. Now, here's the deal. Omeprazole can reduce how much calcium your body absorbs. And we all know calcium is important for keeping our bones strong. So when there is less calcium, your bones may not be as tough as they should be, making them more likely to break. And this is especially concerning if you are 65 and older, or if you have or are at risk of developing osteoporosis. Now, if you are someone on long-term omeprazole therapy, it's a good idea to make sure you're getting enough calcium and vitamin D. This could mean changing your diet or taking calcium and vitamin D supplements according to your doctor's recommendation. Number 4. Low Magnesium Levels Magnesium helps over 300 body functions, from keeping our bones strong to making sure our muscles and nerves work properly. But here's something important to consider. Long-term use of omeprazole can lower magnesium levels in the body and cause a condition known as hypomagnesemia. 
When magnesium levels drop too low, it can lead to a wide range of health issues, including muscle cramps, fatigue, and irregular heartbeats, among others. So here's a pro tip for you. It's always a good idea to check your blood magnesium levels while you are taking omeprazole or other PPI medications. In addition, to maintain health magnesium levels, consider adding magnesium-rich foods to your diet like almonds, spinach, and avocados, or taking magnesium supplements. Number 5. Respiratory Infections You may be surprised to learn that taking omeprazole has been linked to an increased risk of respiratory infections. So let me explain why it happens. As I already mentioned, omeprazole works by reducing the acid in our stomach. But here's the thing, our stomach acid is not just there for digestion, it also plays an important role in protecting us from harmful bacteria. So when omeprazole lowers this acid, there is a slight chance that bacteria can grow in your stomach more easily. And sometimes, these bacteria may find their way to your lungs, potentially leading to respiratory infections such as pneumonia, which is quite a concern. As helpful as omeprazole can be, it's crucial to be aware of this side effect. Now, keep this in mind. In this video, we have covered some side effects that can be caused by taking omeprazole. But it's important to know that this is not a complete list. Beside those we mentioned, omeprazole can also cause other issues like vitamin B12 deficiency, kidney problems, and a bacterial infection known as Clostridium difficile or C. diff, which often causes severe diarrhea and fever. Additionally, it's crucial to understand that long-term use of omeprazole and other proton pump inhibitors has been linked to many health problems. That's why it's recommended to use the lowest dose possible for the shortest time needed. And there you have it. Remember, Knowledge is the key that unlocks the doors to a healthier and a happier you. Thanks for watching.